hello guys welcome to today's video so in this video we are going to be learning about internet service provider who are they Internet service provider actually are a company or business that um takes care they take the service or the responsibility of providing you internet so you don't have to worry about the technology that enables the internet they build it for you you know they will build it for you and bring it closer to you so that's why they take care of okay let's say there is no network in your area internet service provider is going to take care of running the cable they will run the cable mount the mask that will help transmit um uh, internet to you then they will now provide it for you as a service which you pay for a fee now you can now access it at your convenience using ed any of their available technology they are using to transmit internet to you so this actually uh the structure this is actually um what and um, how internet is made available to an end user okay so um how does uh internet service provider make internet available in your home like in what different ways can you connect the internet this is actually way, ways you can connect to internet you have the telephone phone um if you have noticed um in major cities and all that you find cables like this connected so uh, these are one of the ways internet can be transmitted okay so all these cables are like uh, are, are connected to the general or to the global system of interconnected computers through these cables things are run within the cities to be connected to homes offices and all that so what happened is that um once they connect um through the telephone modem through this cable this cable that are connected to the uh, the public internet once it connected to your phone then from your phone uh, from your phone line of from your telephone modem you can now transfer internet uh, com internet service to other devices in your home and all that but the telephone modem is one way internet can be uh, transmitted to an end user you also have the dsl modem now this one is like um, um the your network provider or your internet service provider has the infrastructure probably within your area they have a max that um that is enabling transmit network within the, a specific location so if you are using a dsl service uh they will always provide you um, a dsl modem like this something like this that you can um connect to you can connect them directly you might find one with usb cable which you can connect directly to your laptop or you can find one with um a network uh, port or also a wi-fi D that is a dsl model which you can actually they can receive signal from your internet service provider to your home then you can connect through them with a um a what is it called a network cable or you just connect to them with a wi-fi if your router or your dsl modem has wi-fi enabled okay so another thing we may also find the way internet are being transmitted is the cable modem now just like your tv this is like your dstv the way dstv transmits signal to bring to your home so you can also use uh, sort of those connections like the cable connections to also transmit internet um to your to your house and offices okay so if you are if you are using this kind of technology to connect to internet your service provider will transmit uh internet through uh cable connections then you can use um a cable like um a cable modem to receive signals then you can transmit internet within your um your home or offices okay so and that way also to uh get internet to your house or to an end user is through the satellite uh, connection now this is actually the idea people have about the internet actually the satellite is even the lowest and the less frequent used means of transmitting internet to the end user okay there is a satellite um out there so you have satellite that is at the uh, that is up there then um internet is connected to it to a network signal or antenna or whatever then also for the end user if you are using satellite to connect to the internet your internet service provider is going to provide you a satellite adapter which you can easily um, connect to once you connect to this adapter you can now um, have access to internet in to internet through satellite is not that effective it's not the most fastest way um and in that case it's not mostly used so you always find today a dsl model all over place you find them um, um in in um in different ways like in, in companies like Spart spartanet and smiles and even mtns and all that are developing dsl is more effective and more faster way of uh, connecting to the internet so these are different ways 
internet or end user can get access to the internet now with all this said how uh, in what ways are you connecting to the internet so it can also be from uh, 3g network right um, um some companies has um as uh, as enabled 3g network they have the technology okay so the 3g network also works the same way this um um this component that we have mentioned here also work you may also have um your internet service provider might also have a network max closer to your area where they have um transmitted network and all that too then with um the help of it 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 device or broadband uh, they can distribute the network to you um then you ha also have your phone that is in 3g enabled once you have a device that is 3g enabled you can easily connect to your phone network through their tg 3g technology and also you can access the internet so these are different ways internet has ma are made available but one thing you should know is that the internet itself uh, are made up of a uh, global system of uh, computers that are connected with physical cables okay okay so uh, that is basically it now how to summarize that how do you connect your computer to the internet it's simple you can connect that with a modem you can also connect that with a wireless and wired router so you can also connect that with 3g or 4g technology um once your um, um you have a, a device that has this uh, technology enabled you can also connect that from your internet service provider you can also do that with your phone hotspot so if your home phone has a network you can actually connect the internet of your phone to your uh, your laptop using um hotspot which is also a wi-fi a wi-fi uh technology which your phone has also you can do that with usb tattering okay connecting through usb also you can connect internet to your phone uh with bluetooth tattering so these also are uh, this uh this last um this last um three um ways of connecting to the internet are phone enabled so you can do this with your phone uh, if you don't have a router or you don't have a modem you can actually connect your phone internet with uh, this three method okay so that is basically it about the internet so in the next um video we are going to be looking at intranet the intranet um another form of networking when it comes to comp com connecting computers together so we are going to go over it and learn more about it okay so i will see you in the next video